a still from Saturday night's Strictly Come Dancing could possibly show the moment where Les Dennis' partner Nancy Shu suffered an injury, which left her stemming a trail of blood with a tissue as the couple were interviewed by Claudia Winkleman. Could these pictures show the moment Strictly Come Dancing pro Nancy Shu suffered a bloody injury on the set of the first live show on Saturday night? The 32-year-old Chinese dancer and choreographer was spotted stemming a flow of blood, which could be seen underneath her jaw, following her tango with celebrity partner Les Dennis to the Human League's hit song Don't You Want Me. Stills show that the couple had no contact in that part of Nancy's neck during the routine, which left them bottom of the leaderboard with a mere 16 points. However, at the end of the dance, they shared a warm embrace as Nancy said, Thank you, to Les, and in images from that moment, the area of the dancer's body, which was subsequently left bleeding, clearly makes contact with the former Coronation Street star. Shortly after this, fans spotted the flow of blood as the professional dancer was seen clutching her neck as she walked up the Strictly staircase to be interviewed following her first live performance. She could then be seen holding a tissue to her neck, and she appeared to have blood underneath her chin. Nancy broke her silence for the first time since the incident yesterday with an Instagram post. Sharing a picture of her and Les in action from Saturday night, Nancy penned, That's week one done. Hope we did bring a bit of a smile to your face. Although fans were left with their questions unanswered, as she didn't reveal what had caused her injury. Nancy's injury came after Les revealed that his cardiologist said that they couldn't guarantee he wouldn't drop dead on the show. Explaining that he thought the Charleston would be the most challenging dance for him, he said, I've got to keep my heart rate below about 140, and I don't know whether you can do that in a 90-second very fast dance. The Charleston will be a challenge, but we'll see, he told the Daily Mirror. I mean, my cardiologist basically said, I can't give you a 100% guarantee that you won't drop dead.